So I also just wanted to hop on and uh, show you this situation. So my current outfit is a pair of your dad's boxers that fit me, which is alarming, <laughs> and one of his old work shirts. Pregnancy is so glamorous. What can I say? But we are in the process of painting our bedroom because we want to move our bed over here. We're cutting down this wall. The mirror is going to have to move, obviously. And we still got to finish painting. We have to paint the ceiling and everything. But I want the bassinet to be over there and I'm worried that someone is going to be a little nosy about it. So we need it to be on that side. But as you can see, we have a king size bed and a very small bedroom. So we got to cut the wall down so we can put the bed in this corner and have like a foot of space over there for the bassinet. I will update you when it is done. Happy 27 weeks. So this is my last week, well, our last week in the second trimester, which is crazy. Um, so next week I will be in the third and final trimester, unless you count the fourth trimester, which is postpartum. Show you the bump. Just this, hold on. Ah! is getting very difficult. Oh, yeah. So, gosh, my sister, your aunt, Brittany, is coming over tonight. She's going to sleep over because the doula is coming tomorrow. Um, and ideally, both my sisters will be there for the birth. So, I want them to meet the doula. She, your, uh, your Aunt Brittany is Jewish, so she can't. <gasps> One second. Okay, so I just spent like half an hour cleaning up glass. I put a shelf up. Let's see if I get to show you in a picture. Um, apparently I didn't do a very good job because it just fell and shattered. And now there's glass in the carpet. I vacuumed, but I don't think I got it all. And it was my favorite candle. But I can still use it in the wax warmer. There is shards of glass <laughs> stuck in it, but I'll make it work. Um, I stuck the shelf up using like a rug, like a rug gripper, which that's probably the issue. However, I tried, the, we have a screwdriver and the screws are like, we don't have a screwdriver attachment that fits in the screws that came with the shelf. And I tried to use a drill, and then it just made a giant hole in the wall, and the screw came out because it made the hole too big. So your dad is probably going to have to fix that when he gets home. Um, anyway, what was I saying? Your Aunt Brittany, basically, uh, Shabbat, 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 oh my gosh. The Jewish day of rest, I guess is what it's called. Sorry, someone messaged me. She, um, Brittany can't travel from Friday sundown until Saturday sundown. So during that time, she can't like use technology. Like, I don't even think she can like turn a light switch on. Um, so the duel is coming at 9 a.m. Saturday. So in order for her to be able to be there, she has to sleep over tonight. And then your Aunt Angela is coming, like, Saturday morning. And then she has to leave early. Sorry, so I keep getting work messages. I am on the clock, so that would make sense. But this has been a very stressful morning. And that shelf falling did not help. I re-put it back up. I know it's going to fall again. Yeah. Okay, well, I hope when you're watching this, you're having a much better day than I am. But, yeah. Oh my god, whiskey. You are kicking me, like, every five seconds lately. I've had really bad restless leg syndrome at night, which is a pregnancy thing. And I just can't get comfortable. I also cut my leg, which I don't know if I can show you. 
I went into the Four Seasons room. Can you see? Where'd it go? Yeah. And I like tripped over a bunch of trash that we have in there. And like a nail or something caught my leg. Just having a bad day. That's okay. Cause you can't have good days without bad ones, right? Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, bye. Happy Father's Day! Thank you. It's your dad's first one. And we'll get to... It got cut off. What was I saying? In two months-ish, two and a half months. I don't know how long. So I'm gonna be seven months next week. And you're pregnant for nine, so that's... I don't know. Assuming I don't go past my due date. <laughs> I'm so tired. Your dad's gonna be an actual dad, like a full on cute face dad in two months ish. Thanks for giving me this opportunity. Anytime. Actually, not anytime because I don't want to do this again. Um, I was talking to her. Oh, <laughs> screw me. The one who's doing all the work. We're going out for breakfast. And I'm sick and sniffly. Okay, bye. What is this? That's a nose. Chances are, 95% chance that the bedroom's gonna look different by the time you're born. <laughs> Hopefully not. How do I Here's the new setup. This is the shelf that um, I broke, that your dad fixed. Cause uh, as you can see, he actually screwed it in. But when I tried to screw it in, it like smoked for some reason. Did you burn a hole through the wall somehow? Oh, oh we got this that. table. Let's see. Maybe you should turn the camera around so you can like see where you're like filming. One second. There's the table she was talking about. Nice. It was the shelf. $15 nice. and it's really crappy. Flowers. Turn around and bam, there's the mirror. There's us. You have that same mirror in your room, but yours is facing the other way. The TV and the dresser over here now. Oh wait, look. My eyeballs. Nice. The bedroom over here. I mean, the bed over here. We cut down some this more is, of the wall. We got this bear for you. But I'm going to sleep with it for now because it's really cute. What's his name? Nutty. What's his full name? Let's not tell her that. He's okay, well, that sounds really there. bad, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Buttered rice over there. No. Wait, let me show her how big Buttered Rice is. Almost the same size as your mother. Nice stand over there. Your bassinet's gonna go over here somewhere. Something like that. Window. <laughs> and here's you! Can you please stop wow. kicking me in the ribs because it's not fun. I can't sleep. Kick her in the bladder. You do. And then I pee my pants. That was our room tour. And in... What's today? Sunday? Oh my gosh, I can't see. In... Sunday days till Thursday. Oh my gosh. Four? Five? Four. Four. In four days, we're going to be in the third trimester. Which means... Because the end of June is next week. This will go upcoming week. This will, no, next week. Next week. And July, we have literally something going on every single weekend. So that's going to fly by. And then you could be born in August, technically. The doula thinks you're going to be born on her birthday, which is August 27th. I think you're going to be born August 29th or September 5th. We'll see. You're probably going to go past your due date, though. Like, 
Let's do yeah, statistics. Check the statistics. So let's hope that's not the case. Okay. Do you have anything else to say? 428 weeks? I think that's it. Okay. I think we nailed it. Well, we need a new dog for this dresser. Alright. Bye.